All right, let's continue then. Now it's time for us to create our scroll to top button. This button right here that takes us to the top of the page. Okay, so this is the button. Okay, uh, for that, not only we need the code, but we are going to need, in case you have not yet installed it, we need this package, so you need to install this package in case you have not installed it yet, but you also need to install React icons because we're going to be needing that, okay? So that out of the way, let's start by finding the correct component, which is this one, scroll to top button. And as usual, this was this boilerplate was created a long time ago, okay, when we started this project. So if you do not know where to start, just check this video's description, okay? And there, there will be a link for the full playlist of this project, which is going to allow you to go from the beginning up to this moment, okay? That out of the way, we can actually do it this and forth because this is not necessary and we can use this um, and we can start building this thing okay so let's go to our project and one more time just like the footer or like the payments section we want our scroll to top to top button to be on every single page of the website which means we can actually start by going back, going to layout and importing the scroll to top import um, scroll to top button from components, right? And you can place this pretty much anywhere, but I'm going to place this right below the children, okay? So this is what we want to have. And now we can go and build uh, this up, okay? Scroll to top. It's in here, but it's gonna be correctly position, positioned, trust me. So let's just close this and let's start by um, importing of course we need to import import uh, scroll to top import scroll uh, to top from react scroll up there you go this is the package and we also need to have access to uh, the react icon so import and the icon name is uh, BS on the other ground, okay. BS fill and rocket fill. This will be it from um, React icons uh, BS. So this is the icon, okay. Um, I think this is all good. So now we can actually work on this. So this outer div, we can start by um, styling it a bit. So class name, class name. And I want this to be relative, okay? And I need to use a higher Z index. So it goes on top of the footer and stuff like that. So the custom amount that I decided to go with is 300, okay? Okay, this is like the container, okay? Now we need to actually use the scroll to top component. So we can say scroll to top and we can actually go here, paste that, and do it like this. So this is the icon, okay? And we can pass show under. So when you scroll down, 
up to a certain uh, when you this is what defines when this icon is going to be visible and i decided to go with this number you can play with this so it's gonna it's not visible and i can show you here so the icon pretty much is not visible there's no icon even if i refresh but when i scroll when i keep scrolling see it appears and disappears of course if you want it to to appear faster or lower or whatever you can play with this number so you play with this number for your your own project okay this is what controls that um now i'm gonna have um the icon itself okay so i'm gonna actually style i'm gonna actually add the p tag i'm not really sure if this is the best tag to do so but let's stick to this let's see if it it's not a bad idea and i'm gonna style this and then this icon which is the rocket itself is gonna go right here this is a self-closing one so i'm gonna format my document and now i can style this i want my font to be bold text custom gold text uh, custom gold custom underscore uh, gold okay i want cursor pointer which is the usual right i also want this to be a bit bigger so text i want text 3xl so it's big enough actually on other i want to show a border so there's no border on this icon but when i hover see so that's what i'm doing with this other class so on other border two and on over i want border um custom underscore gold and of course you can play with this i'm gonna actually use view word wrap okay cool um and i need to also on never just on over i want to give it a rounded full of course so it's like a circle and a padding of three to all sides so if i go here let me see what happens okay looks like there's some error why is that okay there's an error let me see ah of course funny hold on i think i know what it is funny enough is i believe this library needs to use use client and i was expecting that to to be the case but the error is not that let me see what this does if i just say use client it's compiling again oh and it worked of course now you cannot really see where you're scrolling we can go to the home page now you can see see it is not visible you scroll down you start to see it on other you get this ring around it and if you press you are taken to the top so it is working funny enough this error this time uh, was not um so easy to figure out but yeah that was because this uh, package needs to use use client due to the version of next.js that we are using that was the thing okay so one more thing down and yeah so yeah the, the home page it's 
totally finished. The live version uses this shot box, WhatsApp shot box, but a part of that we built it all. Of course, we are using different images, uh, but a part of that, this is exactly the same thing. And that was the goal. So yeah, I'm happy with this. Let me know if you want to, if you want me to keep building this project, because uh, I was expecting to get more views with this project and I did not get them so I'm considering not continuing this project unless I have a fair amount of people saying yeah keep building this because we want to learn it if I don't see that fair amount of people saying keep building this project on the comments I will stop building this project but if you go back and check all the videos prior to this one you will see there's a few and you will still learn a lot so it's up to you so just let me know in the comments if you want me to keep building this project or not it's on your hands to make this decision so i will see you on the next video bye